All right, let's start. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. Damn. Is that five fakers lifting up the world championship trophy? Yep. Is that Masu? What the fuck? Who the fuck is that? <laughs> Wait, who the fuck is this, bro? Deft? This looks like Deft. Who the fuck is that, bro? That's a G that's a BLG player. I literally have no idea who that is. Bro. That's Bin? That that's not Bin, bro. No way this is Bin. This looks nothing like Bin, bro. This looks literally nothing like Bin. Let's have Pouring in. You laid on the floor again. One knock at the door and then we both know how the story ends. You can't win if your white flags out when the war begins. Ooh, shots at Casey in the beginning of the video. Aiming so high but swinging so low. Trying to catch fire. But oh, aiming so high but swinging so low, bro. Who caught that bar, bro? Who caught that bar? Aiming so high, but swinging so low. Hey, bro, they 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 fucking know. It's so cold, holding inside and hope it won't show. I'm saying it's not, but inside I know. Wait, who is that? Feeling so cold, lags out when the war begins. Aiming so high, but swinging so low, trying to catch fire, but feeling so cold, holding inside and hope it won't show. Okay. I'm saying it's not, but inside I oh, know. It's gonna be the day you notice, cause I'm tired of explaining what the joke is. This is what you want. Okay, she won. Who the fuck is that, bro? Is that Chovy? That cap was long? Oh, that kind of looks like Bin. They, they like did his mouth. This kind of looks like Bin now. I'd be able to get Bin now. That's Cap. God damn, bro. Caps went to Turkey or what before this video? Who the fuck is that, bro? Hey, T1. Turn to run now. Look what it's become. Wait, out number ten to one back then. Nah, this is actually. Which one is Guma? Is this Guma? That's Caria, yeah, cause Thresh. This is Guma. Ain't no way that's Guma, bro. Like that. That's just not how he looks. I don't know. Also, just give him glasses. No, he always wears glasses. Turn to run now, look what it's become. Out number 10 to 1. Back then, should have bit your tongue, cause there's no turning back. This path once it's begun. You're already four. on that list. Four, so you yeah. don't want what you can't resist. Waving that sword when the pen won't miss. Watch it all falling apart like this. This is what you ask for. Enemy is the crowd. Fire in the sunrise. Ashes raining down. Try to hold it in, but it keeps bleeding out. This is what you ask for. She's actually fucking good, isn't she? She is actually fucking good. That like it's impossible to replace. It's, she's actually in an impossible situation because it is impossible to replace the person she's replacing. But I mean, she's clearly, clearly talented. Mike Shinoda. God damn, bro. Can you imagine if T1 didn't make worlds? Could you imagine what would have happened? They would have been like, yeah, uh, we're delaying the fucking music video by... We're going to delay it until 
group stage this year to Swiss stage to make it even more hype. Can you imagine if they didn't make it? Is this Chovy? No way, who is this? Who the fuck is that, bro? That's Chovy? Death number six? Okay. Bro, I feel like there's so many. Leg Look, I like Masu being in the video in the video because, you know, Masu has has a great story and also he's been an insane rookie. But like, they literally have the team that met T1 in the World Finals, qualified for this tournament. They have Zhao, who is like one of the most legendary players of all time. I'm not even a Zhao Hu fan, but how is Zhao Hu nowhere in this video? Maybe I just didn't catch him because like all I see is a bunch of deaths. But like, how is Zhao Hu not here at all, considering? The fact that he was the guy playing against Faker in the World Finals last year, and he's back with the team. Like, I feel like there's, there's a bunch of players missing in a way. Like, Knight not being there is kind of crazy. I agree. I feel like, I mean, they, they really want to do... Okay, so obviously they're doing this because there's so many T1 fans. So they have to make it T1 focused. The problem that I have with videos like this is not really anything with the video, but it's just the reaction to the video is fans will see this like fucking brain dead T1 fans will watch this video and then they'll they'll go into it being like T1 is the final boss. And then if you fucking go do your tier list, you're like, eh, I think uh, Faker is one of the like bottom five mid laners out of all the major regions. If you say something like this, people just instantly start fucking attacking. They're like, what, bro? He's the final boss. Like, look, he's the T1 is the heroes of the uh, of the fucking video. They're the best team in the world. It's like, no, they're not the best team in the world coming in right now. They're the defending champions. There's a reason why they're in the fucking video, right? They're the most famous team. But like, they, it actually isn't what they're showing here where it's like, damn, bro, like T1, T1 is, is the, the team that everyone has to beat in order to win. Yes, they're defending champions, but the way that people view it is completely wrong. It's not, it's like if the Nuggets may, or like the, the Celtics make the playoffs next year and they're like a seven seed, you'd be like, uh, I mean, sure, they're like good, but they're a seven, like they shouldn't actually win. But a lot of people just don't understand the context of like the reason they're here is because of the fact that they won last year. But that doesn't actually give them anything in this. Like it's just a video.